hydrogen radius of orbit. Derivation Hydrogen atom consists of one proton in nucleus and one electron revolves around the nucleus. Two types of forces are present in the atom. One, centrifugal force and two, centripetal force. The force of attraction between electron and the nucleus is centrifugal force, columbic force. That is, centrifugal force is equal to minus E square by R square. Equation 1. The force pulls electron away from the nucleus is centripetal force. Centripetal force is equal to minus mv square by r equation 2. Electron revolves in stationary orbit. That indicates equation 1 is equal to equation 2. Minus e square by r square is equal to minus mv square by r cancel r and minus on both sides. You get e square by r is equal to mv square. Equation 3. According to Bohr quantum condition, mvr is equal to nh by 2 pi. Bring mr down, you get v is equal to nh by 2 pi mr. Square on the both sides, v square is equal to n square h square by 4 pi square m square r square. Equation 4. Substitute equation 4, equation 3. E square by r is equal to m into n square h square by 4 pi square m square r square. Cancel common ones. You get e square is equal to n square h square by 4 pi square mr. Bring e square down and r up. You get r is equal to n square h square by 4 pi square m e square, where r radius of orbit, n number of orbits, n 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 to the infinity. H Planck's constant. H is equal to 6.625 into 10 to the power minus 2 ergs per second. Pi is equal to 3.14. M is equal to mass of electron. M is equal to 9.1 into 10 to the power of minus 28 grams. Electron is equal to charge of electron. Electron is equal to 4.8 into 10 to the power of minus 10 ESU. And substitute above values. Rn is equal to 0 0.529 into 10 to the power of minus 8 n square centimeter. Radius of nth orbit. 